Hi viewers, I received this package from the United States the other day. So let's, uh, as you can see, I've already started opening it. So let's crack on and see what it is and who it's from. Oh, looks like we have a note there. Dear CCT, after all these years, looks like I landed a lemon from the local coin store. She had got a large load of bars in and I guess she didn't test them all. Proves no one is perfect. After so many years of great deals and friendship, I didn't have the heart to take it back. No, I don't blame you. Instead, I thought you may enjoy doing what you do best. <laughs> I'm 99% sure this bar is fake. We sent some chocolates from good old PA for you and the family to enjoy. Don't eat it all yourself. <laughs> Plus a little piece of silver for you to enjoy. Well, I think it's silver. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure it is. Well, the hibernation time is almost over. Wishing you and yours an early and warm spring. Take care of the part-time preppers. Well, thank you so much, my friend. Whatever is in here, let's have a look. We have some rather sticky, thin, sticky bags. Hmm. Let's see what's here. We have some chocolate by Gertrude Hawk. Never heard of them. Milk chocolate, interesting. And lava cake. I wonder if it contains genuine lava. Might have to try that one first. Peanuts, all lovely. And almonds, all very nice, my friend. Much appreciated. And. What else have we got in here? We have some Roundup and Stallion candy. Well, we all know what these are intended to look like. I'm curious to see if that is the case. <laughs> if they are intended to look like an item that one lights and puts in one's mouth. Uh, yes, I remember these as a child. I think they did have a red end on them. <laughs> I think they're banned in the UK now, I'm not even sure. But uh, thank you very much. I might have one of those in a minute. Yes, that is my phone beeping. And what else? This looks like an Easter gift. Easter bunnies, pink. They look like they're made of sponge. I'm sure my uh, United States viewers probably see these all the time, but I've never seen anything like it. <laughs> Fluffy bunnies. Oh, I look forward to... Uh, trying those I presume they're edible <laughs> anyway on to the package it looks like it's busted out at the end oh yeah probably slid out side to side we, that's, I think that's everything we have a chocolate one cent in or, well is it copper no it's chocolate <laughs> uh, what else have we got Oh, we got that's empty. We have a silver round by the look of it. it looks like proof like the triumph of man's will to survive. I can't quite see that on my camera screen, but it says nuclear non something or other treaty from the United Nations. Well, that's unusual. I'll uh, look that up later, my friend. What year is that? 1972. Oh, I was gonna, I was gonna make a comment then relating to my age, but I shall refrain. <laughs> and we have a rather shiny-looking Scottsdale bar, which looks unusually thick, I must say. But. Uh, Anyway, we will save the investigation of this for another video. Actually, it feels a bit heavy as well. I could be wrong, but we will uh, investigate that one in another video, I think. So anyway, for those of you who aren't subscribed to Part-Time Preppers, I'll leave a link in the description. And for those new to my channel, um, there is a playlist if you hit my about tab up there with all my fake silver videos in so anyone can if this is fake of course 
Um, so if anyone can come up with a suggestion of how to terminate this in a method that I haven't yet used, I'll send you a free gift if I use your method. Anyway, thanks for watching and uh, keep calm and keep stacking.